But this withdrawal agreement is a complete betrayal for this reason, that actually it is accepted by the government that we, during that transitional period, and, and perhaps and more likely indefinitely, will be in a position where the other 27 member states are making laws over us and imposing them, we would be accepting them under a prospectively new act of parliament called the Withdrawal Agreement Bill, which they're hoping to enact in consequence of the Withdrawal Agreement itself. And we would therefore be effectively neutralising, castrating our ability to be able to govern ourselves simply because it had been decided in this withdrawal agreement. The effect of it is to put us into a position where we'll be controlled and the laws will be made and imposed upon us by our stupidity in accepting these arrangements. And there will be no transcript, no reasons given, no explanation of why it had happened within the Council of Ministers, all of which would take place behind closed doors. It is a completely and totally undemocratic arrangement. It completely cuts across the decision of the British people on the 23rd of June 2016. It completely cuts across the uh, repeal of the European Community Act 1972. And they're even proposing, and this is an even more breathtaking, to adjust the European Community Act 1972 in order to enable us to be able to go back into effectively the European Community Act 1972, which is so breathtaking you can't even imagine it even being thought of.